Later this week, in fact, on Friday, the world premiere of a new play will hit the stage at D.C.'s historic Ford's Theater. Something Moving, a meditation on Maynard, tells a story of the once-in-a-lifetime election of Maynard Jackson, Atlanta's first black mayor, through the voices of Atlanta's own citizens. We're joined today by director Seema Sueco and actor Constance Swain to talk more about this incredible production. Thank you so much for coming in. Thanks for having Thanks. us. Thank you. Yeah. Absolutely. So, Seema, I want to start with you. I mean, we're, you know, honoring the 50th anniversary of Jackson's historic election. You know, as the director of this show, why is this story so important to tell right now? I feel like we're living in a time of um, polarization, cynicism, apathy, and what Pearl Clegg, the playwright, mm -hmm. has written um, inspires joyful action in in me in I think the fellow uh, collaborators mm -hmm. and hopefully in the audience and I think it's something we can all use at this time it is indeed something moving which she's created yes yes and I've seen some of the images I'm looking forward to seeing the show uh, Constance you and your fellow actors really try to make the audience feel like they were there yes 50 years ago for that historic election I mean what is it like being a part uh, of this ensemble I mean, it is a blessing in short, honestly. It is exactly what I think one hopes to be a part of when we set out to do this thing, this, you know, be artists and to come together and to collaborate and to tell stories that evoke change. And I don't believe that the audience will exit the way they came in. Mm -hmm. And I think that is the most exciting is that there's something for everyone to take away. Yeah. And that was going to be my next question. You know, what do you hope the audience kind of uh, <laughs> walks away with after seeing this show? Agency. Agency and hope and knowing that it, or this story is about ordinary people who came together to do something extraordinary, something that had never been done and it can kind of feel like, oh, well, that, that can't happen anymore and that is so not true. So I hope that people walk away and feel agency over their lives, over their communities, over their, I mean, over their world, absolutely. Yeah, I don't know, obviously you're part of the show. <laughs> but Seema, as the director watching Constance and the rest of the actors on stage, I know you guys are finishing up these final rehearsals. What's it like for you to see what they've been able to put together in this story? It's magic. Uh, what a joy it is to work with artists of Constance's caliber and the entire team. Also, I, I like to say while we've been working on the play, the play's been working on us. Yes. The themes in this play about collectivity, mm -hmm. community, all of us through working on it have changed a little bit in our own lives. Oh, yes. One of our fellow actors, Shibangi Kuchibotla, mentioned that she uh, went home a couple weeks ago and normally would just walk past her neighbor's house, but her neighbor happened to be out and she said hello and they had a conversation. And that might seem like something so small, but it was actually something monumental, the idea of people connecting with people, mm -hmm. seeing themselves as community. That's a big part of this play. And so the play has been working on us. We have a community pantry backstage. <laughs> awesome. We're practicing solidarity yes. economy. So yeah. it's been a lot of fun to work on. Mm -hmm. And I know it's going to be an incredible show for audiences here in yes. DC to see. Thank you so much. And you can go and check out Something Moving, a meditation on Maynard at the Historic Ford's Theater downtown Friday, September 22nd through October 15th. Tickets available on the theater's website and at the box office. We'll be right back.